Welcome, Ophiosis. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back, Ophiosis. Uh, um, it is um, a business career um, reading and it is a timeless reading. So whenever you pick it up, it is a time that you should be listening to this reading. So Ophio says, um, I see you ladies, something is going to be happening to you women at the end of the month. I see endings are coming in. Um, so I see ending of a contract, some sort of a judgment, some sort of a regrets uh, over a situation. I see um, unhappiness because of conflicts on the work floor. You can see that it is so clearly um the third week is the week where we're um going to be looking at very deeply um because the third week is going to be having some sort of a significant information so you have judgment and you have the empress now um this is what is governing your reading judgment is in the first week um because the first week of november some of you could be Receiving some news that a contract is not going to be extended or a contract is uh, going to be cancelled for some of you. I see you are deciding to look for a new job or a new business or a new career advancement. So I see October, you turn your back and uh, the first week you realize uh, um, that, whoa, this is going to be harder than I thought. And the second week, I see you regretted that you turned your back or you regretted that a contract was open. But um, and you have uh, cleared your karmas up with that company or that um, person. Third week is the third week is where um, it is going to be good. Um, so the third week is going to be a really, really positive time for you guys. So, a lot of you Ophiosis could be hearing or having issues with the renewal of a contracts or um, problems with people on the work floor, um, realizing and having regrets. Some of you could have changed companies, start a new company, and you realize in the first week, I am not sure if this was the right decision. In the second week, you're thinking, oh my God, um, had I not, but this is a much better paying job in the third week in the fourth week i see the magician is like waking you up and the magician is showing um some of you how to create your own wealth and it's like the magician is saying hello hello why the regrets um you know you can be a freelancer or you can create your own business but the second week is going to be the week where you need to be advancing yourself because Whatever is happening in the second week, a whole lot of issues is going to be created around you. So the second week is going to be creating some sort of a significant um, uh, situation that is going to be happening and transpiring. So you have to be aware and on top of your game as whatever is transpiring. You have to take the rein and create your own wealth and financial stability. A whole lot of conflicts, whatever the conflicts is and was, um, that was created around people on the work floor. Um, it is going to be over, but um, this conflicts would be over, but it's going to be leaving you with a whole lot of regrets, okay? But uh, money is going to be coming in. So, Business contracts is going to be ended. There is no questions about it. A whole lot of business contract is going to be ended. Okay, so be aware. A judgment call is coming up on the people who you collaborate with and work on the work floor. Um, some of you that add, uh, um, have a business contract with family members or with friends, I see you might be getting out of this because you're realizing that you do not want to be the one who is responsible for whether their success, whether um, they're going to be successful or not, because you realize that these people um, do not take responsibility for themselves, but it's always uh, um, throwing the responsibility on someone else's shoulder. And I think a lot of you are going to be realizing and that people need to be responsible for for, what, for their success or um, their, um, you know, 
uh, yeah, it is more people need to take responsibility. Um, and I see that this is going to be a situation where um, people need to take responsibility for themselves. Ladies and gentlemen, I was blown away. How are you seeing this, ladies and gentlemen? I love this deck. I'm going to do a review on this deck. How are you seeing this? Do you see the mouth cap use? Oh my God. Oh, when was this card developed? Are you seeing this, ladies and gentlemen? The mouth caps. That is unbelievable. I just got this deck. It was uh, already out. So if you or someone who have this deck, go check out the five of ones to see if they had mouth caps on it. Because my version is a new version. It came out in this year. Oh my God. I just saw that. Anyway, um, there is going to be definitely um, be some sort of an issue. And a major arcana is about a judgment about an end. So a huge judgment call is going to be coming up. And a lot of people could be receiving that your contracts or um, is going to be handed. Okay. And I see a whole lot of sadness and regrets. But ladies and gentlemen, you have to understand that you work out your karmatic relationship uh, as you work with companies. So if you seem to be losing your job left, right and center, um, it's because you're, you're ending these karmatic contract. You're definitely, definitely ending these karmatic contract. You're letting go of these karmatic contract. You're moving on in a very positive direction because you realize that you got to, um, end these, uh, karmatic issues, problem and situation that was transpiring. So I see truth is going to be coming out and, um, a lot of you are not going to be agreeing with um, the other people around you, but it is as if, okay, so it is what it is. And I see some of you in the third week is going to be thinking, oh my God, you know, I was worried um, about this situation because I see judgment is going to be coming down where a lot of you are going to, and then the third week you're going to be thinking, this is going to be okay. I will get, get um, out of this. And you're going to be, you know, Taking it easy and really um, planning, planning. What are you going to do? Are you going to be a freelancer? I see freelancers and business people. The third week is going to be good. So whatever is transpiring for freelancers and business people, third week, fourth week is going to be good. So this is going to be good. Now, some of you are going to be hearing some sort of a news um, that um, a Leo woman um, 45 years and older or a Leo woman on a whole, um, is going to be charged for a huge criminal, um, offense. Okay. So, um, expect this. And I think that that's why some of you are saddened. It could be your company or it could be someone who you had given a reference or you had taken on in a company. And I see a lot of conflicts because they're going to be asking you, didn't you, um, look at this person resume before you took this person on? So they're going to be finding out that a Leo woman for some of you had created some sort of a criminal offense where a lot was stolen from a corporation institution. And it's as if some of you are going to be uh, the one who is getting um, the hit for it because they're going to, you're going to, you were the person who had, um, uh, um, like you were the person who had uh, um, take this person on, interview this person, and they're going to be, you know, making you feel as if, you know, you should have seen this. So I see some sort of an end is uh, um, coming in. Some of you that started a new job is wondering in the first week, was this the right decision that I changed jobs? A lot of you are wondering that. Um, a lot of you are realizing that maybe this new place, uh, there is too much conflicts around. Um, no one is seen eye to eye. And you're like, yeah, was this the right thing for me to do? It was better that I stayed in my whole job. But um, this, you know, you got the job. So that means that you need to heal some sort of a um, karmatic issues. Okay. Who are you going to be dealing with? You're going to be dealing with um, um, the Pisces, um, the Cancers, the Scorpions, the Leos, um, mm -hmm. Pisces, Cancer, and Leos, um, the, the Empress, but this is going to be, 
um, a situation where some of you could be receiving, um, and this is like a, your home business, um, um, or a freelancer. Okay. Um, so it's as if you are a business person, a woman. So women, it, it's like the third week. Of, um, if you're a business person, the third week is going to be good. A lot of you women are going to be turning your backs to contracts. I see a judgment call is coming down on a scorpion. And I see the scorpion regretted what they have done and how they have created conflicts between other people. And the scorpion regretted every moment of it. And uh, I, I see the scorpion wants to apologize to a manager or apologize to a boss is as if... Uh, they created some sort of an issue that is affecting a boss. Um, I see um, regrets. A judgment call is coming down on a Scorpio and, and on a Leo. Whoever the Scorpion and this Leo is, I see huge judgment call. And I see their contracts is going to be ended. So a Scorpion, a Leo, a Scorpion, a Leo, um, a Pisces, some sort of a contract is going to be ended. Whoever these people are at your workplace, you're going to be receiving the message. Maybe you are the one that has to pull the string on these people and this contract. But I see some sort of a contract is going to be ended for these people. Um, this reading is going to be extended. Okay, there is going to be an extended of this reading. So if you want to see the extended of this reading, it is going to be good in order um to um come over on the other side ladies and gentlemen this reading is timeless and whenever you pick it up whatever questions you have the answer is here um the extended reading is just a dollar 99 so if you are interested to see the extended of this reading which i think you should really see the extended of this reading because there is just so much that is happening and it's transpiring in this reading for a whole lot of you. And whoever this woman is, whether it's you um, guys or it is a Leo woman, whatever is happening and transpiring, um, you are going to be realizing that some sort of information is coming out about this person. So is it that it's affecting you ladies because the magician is in the reverse or is it affecting a um, Leo person? Who is this person and what this person has done? It is good to find out the extended of these readings. Just a dollar ninety nine, ladies and gentlemen. So people, um, some of you, not all of you, on the work floor is going to be finding out that some sort of a um it really are ill regularities had gone on with a scorpion pisces and a leo so a pisces a scorpion and a leo some sort of a unethical uh situation has transpired whether it's a uh, some sort of a fraud that these people have created and i see that they're going to be ending all of their contracts they're going to be so i see a judgment call for a pisces a judgment call for a scorpion a judgment call for a leo's um for business people the third week is going to be good the third week and last week if you're a freelancer person third week and last week some of you are going to be receiving some sort of uh, messages in the third week and the last week. So be open for the message or the offer that is going to be coming in. You got to let go sometimes, ladies and gentlemen. Go check out and cross watch to find out what is coming in for a Pisces person at the workplace because it's not going to be good. Um, what is coming in for a Scorpion person at the workplace is not going to be good. What is coming in for a Leo person at a workplace is not going to be good. It's about their contract is going to be ended. So I love you guys. I am going to be moving forward. If you'd like um, to connect with me on the other side, please do. Or else I am saying never stay until next time.